Hi guys, today we'll talk about the normalization process. How the normalization process work in all the exams. So I'll give you a few examples to make you understand the complete process of normalization. So here I'm giving you one example of four students and compare this course to understand. So we have four students here who set for the exam. So let's assume they are four in the exam. Yep. So uh, there are four going for, let's talk about the CAT exam. They're giving the CAT exam and all of them went to a different center with a different computer to sit for the exam. Yep. So the exam went difficult. Now everybody, every set is going to have a different set of questions. Like there might be few easy questions, but few easy questions in geometry may not be easy for somebody else. Easy question in logarithm may not be easy for somebody else. Yeah, and now they're super tensed about the results. Some of them are happy because their paper went good and some of them are not good. Like for example, this guy is using his hammer. He want to kill everyone else around him because his paper was tough. Yeah, so how to normalize everyone? Because paper can become tough because sometimes it happens. So there's a normalization process. That's where the normalization is being used. In every college, in every exam, they use that. So let's take an example of CET. I want to give an example of CET. These two girls are super happy because one of them got 167, one of them got 171. Paper was easy. But the boys are super sad because their paper was very tough where 134 and 137 was a cutoff out of 200. Look at that difference here. This happened exactly same in CET 2016 where the paper was obnoxiously, obnoxiously different for the two slots. Slot 1 was super happy because the cutoff went to 167, they were super happy. Slot 2 were very very sad. Yeah. And when the result came, imagine who was super happy. Boys were super happy because when they normalize, suppose average is 150. Yeah, JB cutoff was 150. Let's assume that. So all the people who gave the exam and scored 167 on day 1, their score was reduced by 15 marks. Yeah score reduced and the boys who got 134 marks they score increased by 15 marks imagine the case and they have shown that transparently everybody's scorecard cat they don't tell the scores ct they tell the score they, that your scores are increased by 15 marks and there their score were decreased by 15 marks yeah because they always normalize so don't worry about that if the paper become difficult don't worry your scores will improve and paper become easy your score will become uh Reduce. So let's take a look at what is CAT ka formula. This is a formula which is used by CAT. So where M1 is the mean of the slot 1, S is the standard deviation and G is the mean plus standard deviation. So they count 0.1% of the candidates. So suppose 2 lakh people give the exam. So 0.1 of them, 200 people. Top 200 people ka score they will look to calculate the scale score. Yeah, this is a formula which is used by CAT. So don't worry, it's not based on 1%. person. CT is based on 1%. person. Yeah, for example, a coaching class is while I went and topped the exam, everybody's score will be scaled as per his score in that lot. Yeah, here in this CAD, there are now going to be three slots. So this is how the score is going to be calculated as per the record of the top 100 students in quant, dialogic and verbal and overall. Four different scaling is to be done. Yeah, so there's a formula which is used in the CAT exam, which is going to be used. So don't worry. There are three slots in the CAT paper this, this year. So all the scored scores will be normalized. So all the students, for example, you can see all four of them are worried now after the exam, waiting for the result. So the moment the result will be out, their score will be normalized. Yeah. And now the ch check the moment you check your results, you'll be surprised to see scores are no normalized for all of them. Yeah. Now those who have the exam, which was very, very simple, they might see a score reducing by four to five marks. And the exam, which was very, very tough, you will see your scores going up. Yeah, scores going up is more important. Score coming down 2-3 marks, trust me, frag nahi padta. And all of them are happy now because their scores have been normalized. This is how the normalization work. Yeah, they are going to make everyone happy so that everyone is on the level platform. Because it's impossible to keep all the slots ka question exactly same. They can't give you same question because then the question can be copied. So they're going to give you similar question. Yeah. If you like the video, please do like and share with your friends.